Okay, okay. Uh, well, hello and welcome back to the Reality Check video review. We're going to be doing something different from a 3D printer because, you know, you guys, I'm sure you love 3D printers, but you want to see something different. So, what could we do that's different from 3D printers, yet is I have a great idea? What could it be? Let's check it out. Let's go ahead and uh, open it up with... Uh, we're going to go ahead and use the 3D printer knife. Uh, sometimes when we have some malfunctions in the 3D printers, one of the things that we can do is we can actually uh, we can heat it up. So we're going to open this guy up because I don't I want to make sure it's nice and easy. So Looks like it was kind of put together with a net a8 parts but here we have a, a nej an, an engraver i'm not really sure how to, to pronounce the the brand name of this one right here but it's just a, a tiny small uh, engraver right here that we have uh, on kind of a, a cnc type bed as well as uh, we've got a laser up here on top and that laser of course is what's going to do the the trick of getting us our, our, our engraving and of course there's a fan up here on top we've got a kill button i believe that is maybe that's a start button maybe it only has one button it only has it only has one button. So, <laughs> all right. Um, this thing seems like it's all set up and ready to go. Uh, it's got a few pieces of tape in there holding everything down. I'm gonna go ahead and take those pieces of tape off right now. Let's go ahead and see what's inside here. We've got uh, oh, quite a few things. <laughs> Number one, the most important thing is it gives you a, a pair of glasses here. One of the pieces is not put in there, but that's a simple fix, okay. So you've got these cool nifty glasses. Yo. Alright, so, uh, yep, yep, yep. That's, that's gonna really help us if we wanna stare at the laser when it's going. Um, I wonder if this would be good for staring at the sun. Ah, uh, eclipse glasses? Ah, uh, maybe, no, probably not, probably not. Oh, we don't want to do that. Um, they gave us some test pieces of wood as well as some other test pieces here. Um, this is a very, very inexpensive device. So if you want to engrave things like watches, you know, uh, your iPhone, uh, pieces of paper, there, there's just all kinds of things that you can engrave with a machine like this. So uh, I'm really excited to get it started here and to take a look at some of the stuff. There also is, of course, a CD in here. <laughs> which gives you access to. Okay, it looks like we have one is for power and the other one is for a data connection. So right now we're actually downloading the software but you can actually see here on the little uh, computer screen that it shows you uh, it's got some uh, information as well as tutorial. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and see if this uh, GPD is gonna go ahead and be able to power this guy right here. Make sure you take out these pieces of styrofoam. There are, there's two pieces of them stuck in there. They are to make sure that stuff doesn't move around during shipping, but of course uh, you need them to be taken out so that they can actually move properly uh, once it's time for them to move. So, I'll go ahead and move these cables. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and take one of these pieces of uh, paper that it gave me. It's just a very, very thin cardboard. I'm going to go ahead and put this guy in there, and instantly you can see a very bright laser light actually coming off of it right there right there in the center. Okay, so here you can see right now we've got the engraver in there, and uh, actually there's a little nozzle in here, and if you switch the, or move the nozzle around, you're able to actually focus the laser 
and when you focus it to be a fine tip is where you want it to be. You can see like right there it's a big kind of blob. It's actually too big, we don't want it like that. I'll actually make it even a little bigger. You see how it's just a big, big little blob right there. It's just completely unfocused, so we're gonna wanna turn it the other direction. And when we turn it the other direction, well, it's right here. It shows us that it uh, is much, much more finer right there. We can see kind of once it kind of hones in. So wearing the glasses, you're actually able to see just a little dot without the little pieces flaring off of it. Uh, and it's really much easier to get a better you know, idea of what it's supposed to be or where it's at. Okay, so right now I feel comfortable that the engraver is set up. It's got a power cable plugged into it. It's got a cable plugged into my little laptop right here and I've got a little reality check logo. I'm going to go ahead and hit send image to the machine and I'm going to go ahead and see what happens right here. Erasing memory. It says it's now downloading and we're going to go ahead and see what happens from right there. We will send the image to the machine. So it's right now it's going to be sending the logo to the machine. I'm going to go ahead and hit the start button. Here we go. Okay, so there it's done. I'm gonna be sure to do some uh, updates here very, very soon with it. And uh, I've got some other pieces of wood here that I'm gonna go ahead and start carving right away. It's very easy to put them on there. And of course, like I said, uh, to put the picture in there, once you've got the picture in, you can just adjust the size of it, the focus. It's very, very simple to do. You can get an engraver like this. It'll you know, carve all kinds of different materials. And it's available, of course, on Gearbest for less than $75. You can get it on sale at different times as well for, you know, uh, closer to 50 so it's definitely a very good device if you plan on doing things like that and if you're interested in it i'm gonna go ahead and finish doing uh some more prints today and uh, i will see you guys in the next video all right later Bye. thanks for watching